the thing is that like because I, I get intrusive thoughts which is is the type of is the type of OCD that I get which a lot of people get on a low level is that sort of thought process you get sometimes you know when you're walking next to the edge of a tall building or next to a large body of water and you put your hand in your pocket and grab hold of your keys or your phone just in case just in case your brain goes and sends a little message down your arm into your hand to just go fuck off <laughs> You know, like when someone hands you like a newborn baby? <laughs> and the back of your head's just going, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it, kick it under the couch! It's like that, but ramped up. As a result of that, I say stupid shit all the time, right? And I discovered this, like, because what had happened, like, I, I really hit a rock bottom at this point. I ended up, I'd not been able to work for over a year. I nearly went bankrupt. Um, like, yeah, I know, thank you. Um, <laughs> No, I did, like, one of the weird, like, this is a really weird thing I learned, because on the day that I, I phoned up the Citizens Advice Bureau to find out how you declare bankruptcy, because it turns out you can't just walk into your bank and go, I'm bankrupt, and then walk out again. They need more than that. They want more than that, right? So I phoned up Citizens Advice Bureau to find out how you get away with it, and, uh, and they said, oh, well, what you need to do is fill in a bunch of forms and uh, pay a £570 fee, and uh, that's it, you're bankrupt. And I was like, what? She went, oh, you're filling a bunch... I was like, no, I heard that. What was this about the fee? She went, oh yeah, it's a £570 fee. Like, to declare bankruptcy. She went, yeah. I was like, I thought it would be cheaper. Uh, no. Nope. <laughs> it's like, if I had 570 quid, I would not be declaring bankruptcy right now. I would be probably down at a casino trying to double that and seeing if I can get out of, out of bank, which is probably why I'm in the situation I'm in right now, to be honest. What do I need to... Uh, and she said, well, can you not borrow it? borrow it and like, genuinely that is what got me in this trouble like who the hell am I supposed to borrow it from as well it's like well have you not got any friends that would lend it to you it's like no of course like who's going to lend me 570 quid to declare bankruptcy can you imagine getting a phone call off one of your mates like just going oh yeah can I borrow 570 quid if you had it you'd be going what's it for like and that's the point where like there's nothing you can say it's like um Technically, it's for a piece of paper that says I don't owe you any money. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>